update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this Wednesday, the 26th of January. We're looking at the Dow. Uh, last night we saw the futures uh, rally a bit and then come down sharply. I was looking at my Chapman Wave trend gauge, uh, little monitor, the gauge itself said the high trend yesterday should see some 9 to 11 point at least rally within two days. We saw that last night. Then there was a pullback. Then there was a huge a pre-open move to the upside. And then there was a give back of quite a lot of points. So the Dow itself was only up about 190 at some point. Now it's up 492, up almost 500 points at 34,784. <coughs> Excuse me. These three candles are going to be really important in telling us what we can expect if there is a if there is a, a, a same kind of takeoff that we saw on the first of, de of December, or is this something a little different? How we are late this afternoon after the Fed speak is going to be really important. The S and P, S P X on X. There we go. S and P is up nicely, up 83 points at 444. Uh, we're looking at uh, what 1.9 percent. Dow's only up 1.4, and the Q's are up 2.3 uh, percent. So this so far is very good. This is your first leg A, great leg A in the daily chart. Very important that this sustains and it holds above 4400, which is the 200 period exponential moving average throughout the day. Hopefully uh, into tomorrow it goes even higher. Look at the QQQ, the NDX 100. Uh, trading vehicle at the high of the day, up 8 at 353. It needs to actually hold very well and get to the 357 area. And then you can see the first touch of the 360.83 level of the um, pink nine period exponential moving average. That'll be really important. IWM, the IWM is up 2%, it's up 417 at 203. Uh, almost two of uh, yeah two oh three, and this is a good move to the upside, and it needs two oh four fifty eight to touch the pink um, nine period moving average. Gold pulled back very sharply; it is down seventeen, and the dollar has actually acted very nicely. It's up a little bit, and it's TLT. We'll be talking about in my show, the Tiger Technicians Hour, coming up in a few minutes' time. It's down at nineteen cents. With Fed speak today, it's going to be a really important session. I'll be back in a moment, and crude oil is acting.